Hey there, everybody. Sloppy here, playing some more Creativerse in our beautiful Creativerse world. And, uh, welcome. It's Thursday. Big day. Big, big day. It's almost Friday. It means I can stop working. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Um, yeah. I was going to work on this today, but, uh, I want to do some real building, not this creative nonsense. So, large city hall thing you are being postponed that's fine let's wander through town here give our uh appropriate bow to the emperor penguin and uh move along here things are coming together i am really digging the build we've got going i'm liking this spawn city you know now that the uh server's running better and i have a little bit more time i'm just uh i'm having fun playing creativeverse there is one thing, however. Uh, storage. I started it last time. I am finishing it today. I tell you what. I uh, I just I need to finish this storage room and move everything in here. That's my plan for today. I really want to get this done because... Uh, oh, I hate dealing with like unorganized storage. So, without further ado, let's get on to that, you know? And I think first things first, I want to get the roof on here. And for now, we are just going to do it with these slabs. Um, I like them. I, I kind of like the texture. And, you know, when I was thinking about this, I just... Uh, I don't want to change this pathway. I like this pathway. And then I didn't want the roof to be like in waves, maybe. But we're just going to continue this across and we'll see. I'm not sure I love it. Um, you know, one of the weird things is that because this is kind of like buried inside of this build, you're going to see sort of parts of it. But I guess that's inevitable. We can't just have open lines of sight while also having big rooms and such. So... That's that. Um, so let me get this roof on here. Let's see how it looks. I mean, it's plain, but like, whatever. Might be kind of cool to have a droop, you know? Like, we could have it come right to this layer, in theory. I don't know. Uh, well, then there's a whole block here we would need to account for i don't know do i want it to droop interesting question it does add something if it's got a little bit of shape to it right in theory we could actually uh okay. i don't know why i keep saying in theory though i'm not the person actually doing it so we could do oh my goodness oh the don't rotate on camera that's day one stuff yeah, we could have a sloping roof. That might be kind of cool. Yeah, let's give that a try. I think that'll just add something to the room, you know? Just give it some character. So, I decided to go ahead and make the archway we talked about last time. So, I did want to have an archway going through here. Um, that we're going to have, like, a pathway that you walk through. And that'll go to the back of the house. And then we're going to do a, probably another room over here or something. Um, I did really want that. And then I was building this wall and it just kind of... I was sort of already designing it and thought, you know what, let's just actually make that a reality. So here it is. It's uh, big and chunky and we might change it a little bit. But for now, I kind of just wanted to like actually, you know, make it and then... We can worry about everything else after. And, uh, okay. So, let's get these windows. Just let me click on the windows guy. Uh, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, so let's just see how that looks. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I feel like, uh, that'll extend over... a little bit 
chunky just because I feel like with the dark blue, you can't see any like detail work. So we'll probably have to do some stuff with it, but that's fine. We can figure that out. Maybe bringing like the iron across and down here can add some sort of something, but you know what? Inside out, we'll worry about that later. Here's the roof, which I think looks really good. Um, yeah, I think the roof looks really good on this side. So it slants down, and then there'll be blocks back there, so you won't see all of that. For now, we can kind of fill it in. <laughs> and then, yeah, here, kind of using obsidian everywhere we don't have sort of stuff to fill in. Um, and... Yeah, I'm kind of wondering what to do with all of this now. I do want to leave as much of the original house as possible, but it's also sort of clashing pretty aggressively. So we shall see. So I'll be obsidian. Yeah, okay, okay. Getting there. Um, getting there, getting there, getting there. The pathfinding from these guys is just... <laughs> Oh, uh, it's just wild. Uh, I just really want to be a tightrope walker, I guess. Strange. Okay, uh, we are almost finishing up uh, this walkway. Not sure what I want to do for a roof. Slabs feels perhaps like a little over the top. What did I do? I did slabs over there. Uh, I don't know. But then... I don't know if anything blends that well with the obsidian. And this is supposed to be the obsidian side, so maybe the slabs is, like, the best way to go. Let's see. Let's just build a little section and see. I mean, I hate that I don't hate it. You know what I mean? Like, I want it to be something a little bit more, but it kind of works, doesn't it? Maybe we can add... Like iron, how does it look from the outside? I mean, it just looks like it kind of fits. Yeah, okay. I know I'm going plain, I'm going basic, but it does fit. And we are finally enclosed. Um, <laughs> yeah, this room certainly is something. Um, I'm going to hold off my judgment until all of the blocks are in. You know, anywhere you see the stone is sort of a placeholder. I think once we get other blocks in, this will look a lot different. I'm torn. Um, I, I, I'm not, like, in love with the floor. I think once we get the iron glass, I'll like it more. I'm kind of finding the iron and the obsidian aren't particularly well matched. I don't think those are, like, blocks that you know, really crush it together. Um, that being said, let me fix this. I don't, I don't like whatever happened here. Um, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't like love the blocks together, which I think is holding me back a little bit. Uh, but I do, I mean, I really like the design of this. I think the storage room is pretty functional too, which is cool. Um, and yeah, I, I think once the blocks are in, I'll like it a little bit more. It is a little dark. I've been sort of just adding torches to, uh, get even more lighting. Um, but I may end up doing some hidden lighting or some hanging lighting or something. So we'll see. We'll see. I, I, you know what? I'm happy. I have a storage room. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what's good right now. And you know what? I am going to put blocks away. Look at this. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Sure. I don't really have anything planned out yet. Stone one. All right. Cool. Now I get the fun task of... <laughs> now I get the fun task of actually putting away all of the blocks. You know, is a fun task. So those are mobs, 
and uh, yeah, I opened this up just so I could grab stuff, but yeah, we got a lot to put away, <laughs> and uh, this will probably take the most time of anything I'm doing today. I mean, luckily, it's still early in this, uh, in this series, so I don't have too much, but it adds up. All right, chess, for the most part, put away and organized. We're working out the details. I've got uh, a chest in the middle with just stuff that I'm not quite sure where I'm going to put. Um, but we will organize as we get to it, I suppose, is the, uh, is the strategy. And we can wrap this guy up with one of these. Yep. Now I just need to figure out which fence gate goes over here. <laughs> but uh, we have a... Functional storage room, which is really, really great. I am so very happy we've got this sorted out. And, you know, now that I'm starting to decorate it up and organize it a little bit, it does feel better. It is feeling more real, or I don't know what the word is. It's feeling actual. No, that's wrong. It's feeling good. I, I don't know. It is. It, such a weird way to say it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to say. It does feel like better though, you know? And I, once all of this stone is replaced by the blocks it's representing, I, um, I am feeling really good about it. I'm also thinking I might like leave these chests for a bit, you know? The arc stone ones are great and this side will probably all become arc stone, but the vast majority, I probably don't need more than 35 slots. But we shall see, I suppose. We shall see. Now let me come out here. And you know what? I, like, I think this is looking pretty good, you know? Pretty good. No. Yeah. Where is my touchstone is a good question. It's still down here. Okay. Um, yeah, so I, uh, have something that needs to be done, and I'm going to do it in piecemeal format because it's really boring to do. I'm going to put this here. I need crystal shards, and now I know where those are. It should be in here. I have five. Okay, I need to make teleporters. We are... I have a bunch of everything else, so I can pick up crystal shards while I'm out. We are going to um, work on teleporters to biomes. I think I'm going to get three or four done an episode. Eventually, they'll all be done. You guys get it. You're smart. Tall. Attractive. You get it. Okay, so uh, everything with a torch needs to be done. So we've got one to a swamp, we've got one to a desert, and uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to knock these out a couple an episode until we're finished, and uh, yeah, I guess let's uh, rock and roll. You know what, actually, <laughs> so my plan, uh, we're going to do grass and then two of the block. And then all of them are going to come back to our central teleporter here is a uh, single grass in the middle. It's, uh, it's pretty basic, but it works, and this will be just handy for anyone who has to get around. Well, we've got two more down. We've got the woodlands. I think it's this piece of wood. <laughs> and we've got the canyons. So, yeah. Pretty good, pretty good. Two down, and it took a weird amount of time to uh, 
find uh, <laughs> to, to get these. It was uh, it was frustrating, but uh, we got it, and we also did some uh, slaying, you know, slaying. Okay, uh, yeah, good, good stuff. Well, not one, <laughs> but two Canadian flags. You love to see it. Anyway, I am out of time to record today, unfortunately, but I, uh, glad we got some stuff done here. It is so dark at night. Azalea's is right. It is very dark at night. And, uh, you know, what? let's use some of these to light a terrible path up to our place. Crazy how little light these give off. <laughs> It is absolutely wild how little light these give off. It's uh, kind of neat. Kind of neat. There's probably something cool you can do with that. Anyway, um, thank you guys so much for watching. We got a lot done. Uh, yeah, I am super, super happy with this. This is going to be so very handy, and I am very, very excited about it existing. And we can actually do one of these. Look at that. It's already coming into use. Yes, very, very exciting. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to building more on this house. I'm really enjoying this whole inside out thing and just being kind of weird with it. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think in those comments below. Subscribe for more, all that jazz. And I will see you guys in the next one. Ciao.